Ladies and gentlemen, welcome on into another Man Cave 101 podcast tier list. It is a new year, 2024, and you know what that means. We have to take a look back at the year in review. So, of course, we're going to be ranking every Marvel Cinematic Universe project from 2023. There's definitely going to be some debates on this one for sure. So, before we get into it, let me introduce the guys deep in the heart of Texas. Man, listen, it's Wendy's. What's happening? Yo, we are into a new phase. The old phases are out. <laughs> let us let us move forward. Move forward. The future is bright. <laughs> <laughs> Live from the man cave. It's Caleb Caleb. I'm on God. Leo, what's happening? Oh, let's get it. <laughs> Spread love. It's the Brooklyn way. Big Chief. What's happening? 2024, what's popping? 2024, what's popping? And I, of course, am your man in the chair, A.A. Ron. And boy, I'm sure glad the Deadpool's coming out in 2024. <laughs> that's going to be an easy ranking at the end of the year. I'll tell you that right there. <laughs> All right. So let's just get right on into it. Let's take a look at every Marvel project from 2023. And we're going to go through here and rank them. Let's just start here. So we're going to take Moon Girl and Devil Dinosaur, because that is a cartoon for the kitties, and we are going to take Groot Season 2, and we're going to plop that in the category of for the kids and not give it a ranking, because it would be unfair to rank it based on our terms of ranking. <laughs> so, let's we, just we start there. Be, we shall not be mean. So, let's go in chronological order, not shows, not movies. We're just going to go in chronological order. I believe it's in chronological order here. So, let's start off with how the year started, and that mm. is Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantum Mania, aka solid. Jonathan Major's second to last ride in the MCU. Yeah, bro. <laughs> I'm giving it a solid B just for the majors in it. Just, just because uh, the majors is there. You are generous. I am generous. Yeah. Leo, it's a B. Hmm. I'm not gonna argue that one. That one I'm not gonna argue. It's, it's Chase. definitely a B. Chase, we got. Uh, I was actually thinking C. But I, I I can't lie, like Jonathan Majors definitely pushes it up for me, man. I might have to put it in a B also. Yeah. Um, let me put it to you this way. That's fine. I, I disagree with you guys. I, I would have personally I would have personally said C. That's just me personally. Okay. But uh story, that's where I would have put it. Well, yeah. Jonathan Majors being in it would have put it up there. I thought he did phenomenal, and everybody else was dog shit. That's how I feel about it. I, I didn't like anybody else in the movie. I didn't like Modoc. He was awful. It's <laughs> the worst thing I've ever seen. I, know, I, get, uh, I forgot all about him, man. Like, yeah, 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 exactly. I he's forgot about that. Because he's, he's, he's a dick. <laughs> Not anymore, evidently. <laughs> um, I didn't like any of the other plot points of the movie. I didn't like what they did in the quantum realm. Like, it just, a lot of it was just stupid. I'm going to be honest. You didn't, you didn't like the fact that Janet was no. a whore? Nope. Nope, didn't care. You, you know Kang hit it, right? You, you know he's smashing that. Smash it. Smash it. Smash it. Smash it. Oh, it smash it. Smash it. Like, I what? will put it in B for you guys, and I will let you guys take the brunt of the heat in the comment section because that shit should have been in C or D. Kang Just saying. Singing, do Just you remember the time on that. <laughs> I give it. I give it what I give it because that's he, the, he, he that's fine. Cool. I'm I'm gonna let. I would have ranked it a C or a D. Go after them in the comment section below, please. Come, no, come see me. <laughs> come see me. Anyway, let's move on. Marvel's Secret Invasion. Oh, let somebody else go first. It's a solid C, bro. Uh, it's a solid C. Uh, <sighs> yeah, I'm not gonna disagree with that. It's it. Yeah, it's actually. They did my boy Nick Fury dirty. Yeah, they, they did. They, 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 they did. See, that's why I'm starting to remember saying, now. They, you, they, you wasted Samuel L. Jackson yeah, for an entire yeah. season of a show. I, I but, think, but also the villain in it was, he did an excellent job. Yeah, I thought he was, I thought yeah, he was yeah, fine. Yeah, Gravic was cool. Gravic was cool. Was, but Gravic was cool. Overall, he sold me on it. I, I think it was the, the, the D. Because mm -hmm. I'm not, I wasn't with what they did. That it's it's that that you kill Maria Hill, like nah, man, come on, something like that's that. A, man. Consequences, like, no. Marvel needed yeah. consequences. No, that, that, that's the wrong I, I consequence. Think, like somebody else should have died. I think I think they should have. I think they should have backed off, held held on to it a little longer, so that it could have went to Hulu, and then this this show could have been what it was supposed to be. Probably and, instead of trying to push it out on Disney. To keep it, you know, oh 
Then yeah, I forgot. Secret Invasion movie got to be let loose, bro. I forgot all about. Go. I forgot yeah. all about Super Deformed. There was supposed to be a lot. Kale- of I forgot about Super Deformed Kalisi. We did in get the end. a lot. We did get a couple scenes. Yeah, we did get a couple scenes. Yeah, of, couple of, scenes. yeah, yeah. We we um the spy, the English spy. That lady was a badass. Okay, what I did she? like. I did she like was in her. when she had him in the chair. In the she uh, was yeah, she, she was, was proud. She was like she was like a Jonathan Majors for me in that sh- in this show. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, listen, yeah. I, mean, it, it, I I would put it in C for me. It would be a can C. I can I be honest with you? The CGI throughout the whole show actually really wasn't bad at all. Mm-hmm. Until the final battle, until Khaleesi, yeah, yes. I know. Until the final the final battle yeah. CGI was some of the stupidest shit I've ever seen in my life. It was just super CGI battle with everybody's powers. I, I just I hated it. I, I hated everything about it. But outside of that, the CGI throughout the whole thing was fine. I liked Gravik. Uh, I hated the fact that uh, Maria Hill got killed. Yep. Uh, you know, the, I I would personally say for me it was more like a D. So what did we say? C C D D. I said D. That's a C. So D D C C. Yeah, put it on C too. Um, can, we put, can we put it right in the middle? No. <laughs> I'll, I'll 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 put it in C for now. We'll we'll talk about it. Just make end. a new category that says CD. CD. <laughs> um, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume Three. I'm actually curious what you guys have to say. I'm going to call that an S. A. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to put that in. I'm going to put it in an A. I'm put it That's in an A. S. It's not an S tier. It's not. It's not an S tier movie. How is not an S tier? You got the water bowl. Oh my god. You got the wait. what? What you got? Wait. What you got? <laughs> What you got? I'm, 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 I'm not him. You got the high evolutionary. Uh-huh. Yeah, that was cool. That's, that's, that's not that's not that's you got the, the high evolution. You have um a rocket. You have the true backstory of rocket in it, uh-huh. which that's is com- which is comic book accurate. Uh-huh. And you got a lot of consequences in this. And you saw Peter Quill's freaking uh-huh. emotion come out in this whole fucking movie. Okay. And I love the way Gamora played him like a fucking fiddle. Who died? Who died? When, when Rocket died, his heart stopped, and you saw Quill fucking screaming. And, no, 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 no. He, was, wait, he, wait, was, wait. he was still alive. Who, who's leading the team at the end? Yeah, almost doesn't count. Yeah, yeah don't count. That's why. But, I don't he, but you got his know. friends died. You tell me you didn't feel bad for the freaking hippopotamus. And the, 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 <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes. I felt bad. Listen, let me tell you something. Thieves? I felt bad for Thieves. That was my dude. You can't tell me that hit you in your heart. I felt bad for Thieves. I did. And Rocket's girl, bro. And Rocket's girl. I mean, Lila? And, yeah, Lila, and when she, he saved all the other raccoons, too, that were in the cage oh, at the end. So mm. cute. But, mm. yeah, it's an A-tier movie, bro. Um, Come on now. I have, I have, I have two words for you that don't make this an S or maybe even A tier movie for me. You ready for it? Yo. Adam Warlock. Dude, the, you gotta worst, two, the worst, the worst part two, of the movie. Three, no, three scenes of the movie. That's it. It doesn't. Leo, the, be- Leo, Leo. Wait, Leo. the beginning, the beginning scene was dope. When he Leo. came into uh, nowhere, that scene Leo. was dope. Leo, he got held back by Nebula. He's Adam Warlock. Adam Warlock. Which Stark technology? Nebula. He's Adam Warlock. He wait, 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 wait. I know, wait. Not not full grown Adam Warlock. Uh-huh. It's not full. Okay, so that's so power level and smart is all the way down. Whose fault is that? And 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 what's the and um uh, uh, what's the name? Nebula has Stark technology. So the only person who cut Thanos was Stark technology. And and Thor. And so, so you know what it sounds like to me? It sounds, it, it sounds to me like the MCU didn't want to put Adam Warlock at his full level because they knew he would obliterate the entire fucking movie. Agreed, right? Okay. But that sounds like poor writing by Marvel's part to not have anybody in there to fight him. Oh, That's what that sounds like to me. But th- but the thing is, this is the way you end a good series. I'm not disagreeing. L- listen, Guardians was not a bad movie. I, I wouldn't I wouldn't call it S. I would call it like a B or an A. It was a oh, yeah. good movie. I'd give it an A. It was yeah, a good yeah. movie. It was. But Adam Warlock was literally a big dummy that was obsessed with a pen the entire movie. He was an yeah, idiot. I mean, I mean, he was but, a dummy okay. the whole movie. <laughs> okay, you do yeah. get King Groot too. Come on, huh? <laughs> but I will agree with you that the High Evolutionary was dope. One of my favorite movie. Like it, in a, I have the. We obviously always talk about oh, Marvel. Ma- Marvel has a villain issue, right? A one movie deal. Like Marvel, like Marvel has a villain issue that they all die off in one movie. Yeah. He was a dope one movie villain, in Hell my yeah. opinion, which which Hell has been yeah. difficult for them to do recently. In my, but he's opinion. not even dead though. 
Yeah, well, okay, whatever. He's still okay. a one movie. He's still okay. a one movie villain. But for but, now, he's a one villain movie. Yeah. But here's here's the thing with uh, it, it. It wasn't. It wasn't a. It wasn't a bad movie. No. We won't let Adam Warlock completely overshadow the rest of the movie. No, of course you know, not. Guardians had a lot of textures, a lot of scenes, a lot of big scenes, and it was immense. The way the graphics, you see nowhere mm-hmm. and all of that. So there still was a lot in there that was absolutely You're talking great. about Vin Diesel's group when he came out studying and just shooting them back to back. Where are my guns at? Come yeah, on now. I mean, I mean the, only, cool. the, the only thing that made me slide it from an S to an A is the Adam Orlock stuff because that was yeah. just that was just nasty. Mm-hmm. Um, the other two scenes of Adam Orlock, I do give it. I, it does. Yeah. It does. It, it, do that, that for me. it does that, nothing that, for the character. For I don't know where Adam Warlock falls in the MCU moving forward. He's just like a member of the Guardians team now. Yeah, no, he's in, the he right spot. no he's in the right spot. You think so? Yeah, he's definitely in the right all spot. Right. Because we'll, we'll, right we'll, now we'll he's getting, right now. So 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 whenever they pick up back up on the Guardians, whenever like, they pick up like ten he, years. Yeah, so you're probably <laughs> gonna have a, a real official Adam Warlock. That's yeah, we'll see. More trained, better. Maybe. He said adapted. more trained, like he a puppy. He gonna be more trained. <laughs> Yo, he was literally ten years old in that damn movie. He's gonna go yeah, on the paper. Well, they, the they, they, they should they should have let him cook in the incubator. A they should let him cook. You know what I mean? Floor, bro. Like, Yo, when your boss <laughs> says take this motherfucker out, <laughs> then what are you gonna do? High evolution and said I will kill so, your whole planet. <laughs> so so Leo said S, right? That's so you're sticking with S. Yeah, I'm, I, I'm I said I said B or an A. I'm like hovering between the two. I'll call it an A because I actually do think it was a good movie. And I will rarely give James Gunn props, but he closed out the series well for Guardians. He did a good job. For his, for his closing Guardians thing. I think he did. Chase, what did you say? A. 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 Uh, Wendell, what did you say? A. I'm on an A train. All right. So, Leo, you're not getting your S, but it's, nope. it's A. It's up there. It's an it's A. I will say um, but you know what is going in S? Spider-Man cross... The Spider Verse. Are we? Does anybody disagree? Nah, that's, a, that's, a, that's a D movie, son. Nah, 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 nah. Yeah, yeah, first yeah. off, first off <laughs> nobody, nobody, nobody invited this guy. If he says yeah, yeah, like that. Yeah. <laughs> that was a damn D um, movie. You know what part I didn't like? The dinosaur. It's I like a fucking dinosaur <laughs> movie. <laughs> Your it's, time has been revoked, sir. It's yeah. it's it's very rare that you can get me to sit through a two hour movie and be entertained the whole way through. The this goddamn movie did way. it. The whole Every way through, I was entertained. Three variant. Every the spot, the way they developed the spot throughout the movie, the the the, the Gwen, the Gwen and Miles timeline, uh, Miles' parents, everything, mm, everything, mm, top yeah. to bottom. Listen, I, I ain't gonna it. hold you. The whole highlight of the movie for me was the 1966 Spider Man popping up because I, <laughs> yeah. I did not expect to see him. I was <laughs> like, oh shit. He was in there. God, that was a fucking nah, that was a good yeah, shot. Everybody that was a really good shot. Think in this movie, so I'm completely with it. It's definitely a Love S. It. Love if you if, if you didn't if you didn't like Spider Man across the Spider Verse, I don't know yeah, what is wrong. You with can you. kick all the rocks. It's it's the one rare. it's the one rare time I give Sony kudos on anything up. ever, except Word. my video games. It's animated, <laughs> so, so they so they good. Moving on, yep. Loki season two. Mm. Now this is this is tough. I'm not gonna lie to you. This is tough. tough. There was a lot in this. Does, does any does anybody want to start? Listen, I'll, I'll start. I was gonna say go. If you want to go, go. I'll let you take it. Away. Listen, I'm I'm gonna keep it a full buck. It's a it's a B for me, bro. Ooh, B. Listen, I, elaborate. I, 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 <laughs> yeah. I, 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 in the beginning, I didn't understand what was going on first season. When I caught on, I'm like, okay, I see where we're going with this thing. Um, second season. They, they 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 did wrap this thing up, but it it felt a little rushed, mm. and there really wasn't as many surprises and and reveals as I felt like there should have been and whatnot. There should have been a little bit more, you know, movement, a little bit more conflict in this thing, and it just felt like okay, listen, this is the end of the season. Let's just try to cover all our bases, wrap this thing up, and you know. Uh, and then at the end, when Loki becomes the god of stories and all of that, like I'm like, okay, but I, I wasn't, I wasn't completely thrilled about that. You know, I, mm. I, I just expected a, a better resolution for the entire thing. So, you know. okay, right. fair. Leo, you wanna? You look like you had. Go ahead. I will put this. To be fair, 
I would put this at a B. Okay. Oh, I'm surprised B. you agree. Okay, cool. I would put it at a B just but it's a close like it's 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 it's, it's like pulling it I'm pulling at strings like because BA, you mean yeah I'm pulling at, like at strings to be a because there's there's rarely there's only one scene that pissed me off when he kept going back and forth back and forth with <laughs> uh, uh with okay. Victor Timely yeah, but it, 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 but it did make sense once I double watched it Okay. I was like, okay, so I'm seeing where they're going with it, and I'm seeing, and the thing is, is the, it's making for Loki as a character, he was always second fiddle. Yeah, he was. Now, he's the he's god the of guy. stories. He's, he's the, the, the literally the guy that writes everything. The guy. I say how your future is going to go in my timeline, in my universe, in the multiverse. Yep. And I can end your timeline from here. So. Can you have no more powers? It's you have the powers to jump in between timelines, but if I decide to mess around and mess up your timeline, I could do it at any time and given moment. And mm. also, Jonathan Major's acting when he had the whole him playing Victor Timely was fucking excellent. Mm. And the one thing that I did love is the box when he put when they put everybody in the damn box. Yeah, and they started squeezing that down. Yeah. Yeah. I was like, oh, <laughs> yes, mm-hmm. violence. Mm-hmm. I didn't get to see it. Mm-hmm. That's why you want to be. If I would have got to see that, you would have been at S, right? <laughs> I just want to see some, you got to hear it, but you didn't get the, the mm-hmm. full effect. So that's why I'm putting it at B because it's it was, it was it was a good ending for Loki. I felt like he deserved to be on the throne. Controlling everything like he wanted to or in every movie, yeah. but never got the chance to. And it, it just opens up, Kang. It just really does for me. Fair. Wendell, do you want to go? Or you want me to go? Um, I'm going to be easy and just, yeah, I'll say it to be. Okay. Um, my man, Orboris, killed it for me. I love me some Orboris. I enjoyed um, Jonathan Majors. I, I liked him as the extended version of He Who Remains. Like, I love that whole interaction that he had with Loki. Um, Victor Timely was great, too. Um, but it's a B. It could have almost been a C because there are a lot of things that they did not sew up. Like, you mm-hmm. know, where's Renslayer? You know, like, what happened in that whole entire situation? What happened to Miss Minutes? Well, I said they, they, they reprogrammed her or whatever, but like, you know, yeah, whatever. Booty. <laughs> whatever. Yeah. But you know, um, but yeah, I give it a solid B, man. Like I, I absolutely love the first season. Um, but this one, yeah, it did kind of just fall where it was like, all right, cool, it was great to watch, but I was like, you know, they're like Chase said, there was no wows, there was no big like <gasps> oh my god, yeah. like none of that. None of that there was none of that took place. So, you know. Okay, all right, that's fair. I mean, like I'll obviously you guys oh, you know, majority wins here, so it's gonna go in B. I I would have also honestly said B, and the reason why is because I loved how everything came full circle for Tom Hiddleston as Loki. Um, I just love the fact that how they wrapped that up. I do agree with you guys, though. There were some plot points that didn't really do it for me. Um, but overall, I would say it was it was a solid show. I, I enjoyed the ending. I liked that he became the god of stories. Um, so, I, you know, I'll call it, I'll call it a B just, str- just for my, my boy Tom Hiddleston. If that really was your last run in the MCU, which I hope it wasn't, uh, mm-hmm. you no, know, please don't. I, I'm just saying if it was, you know, I think it was a solid way for them to send him off. But, you know, I mean, like he's busy now. Like, how does he show up anywhere he, else? That's what I'm saying. He's busy now. <laughs> he's busy. I don't, I don't know. Yeah, he is fucking busy. He can't so show up I don't know. Unless somebody goes to see him. That's so, about it. I think this is where we're about to get into the arguments. Why? So, the Marvels. I, I, um, I'm basically going to be out because I will maybe watch it. I will maybe watch it on February 2nd when it's on Disney Plus, or I might not. I don't know. Yeah, it's a guarantee. Um, us. So, I mean, listen, <laughs> I get it here so much. It gets it, it gets the S strictly on the yams. On the um, yammies. On the yams. Um, I'm sorry. This, this 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 unfortunately has to go down into the C. And I mean, it, it honestly could could have been a D. Um, I'm making it a D. That there was. I, let me first. Let me say this. I love the Marvel. I like the idea. The woman team. You have basically um, 
complete different backgrounds, uh, ethnicities. Um, Marvel really needs a, a, a female team in there that kicks ass. Um, but there was just some cringy ass moments in this movie that you could not get past when they wanted to catch the like swallow everybody to save them and all that kind of dumb. I was just like, okay. like I could have, I could have just walked out at that point, bro. It was, like, like, it was swallowing kids, bro. I, yeah, I could have just, I could have just walked out at that point. Um, you know, uh, I have nothing against Brie Larson. I think that she, I think that I she, do. Of course you do. I know you. I know you love Brie. Um, no, I definitely don't. She she wouldn't have been my pick for 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 Captain Marvel. Um, she did not fill out that uniform. Um, I mean, she listen. She gave it a great. You know, she she did what she does, and I was not mad at her. But I was was just wouldn't have been my choice. She gave it the old college try. Yeah, she definitely did that. Um, you know, saying uh, uh, um, photon and and. Uh, and, and uh, Mrs. Marvel, hey, listen, they they were on point for me. I I, I love both of them. Um, and like I said, you know, for the, for the yams, man, we're going for the yams. We're going to throw it in C, bro. Yep. We're going to throw it for C, just strictly on the yams, because I, I got that. I'm absolutely in agreement with you for the yams and for Iman Villani, short, short, doggy, short doggy, yo. I love her. She's a great kid. She did a great job. Um, if it wasn't for her and them yams, this would have been like white dog shit, but I, I'm I'm putting it in C with you. I can I can let it rock there. Um, I like the little training montage they did, like you know when they start figuring it all out. I kind of dug that. I was like, okay, all right, that looks cool. dope. That looked pretty dope. Um, but yeah, that that's it's gonna lie in C, bro. Like this could have been a way better movie, um, but unfortunately it wasn't. So. So now here comes here comes Leo's A. <laughs> Come on, tell us about the comic this, accuracy. This is the most comic accurate it's movie a- of all eternity. Because <laughs> <Okay. laughs> right. you guys, you guys, what you brought it out of me. Okay, so this it, it is comic book accurate. But the one part that I didn't like is the lurking scene. I do did not agree. I didn't like that ending at all. The at all, I did it at the Flurkins, 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 the motherfucking cats. I didn't like that scene at all, and also um, that that's one of the scenes that actually took me out. Not even the whole everybody had a problem with the singing, singing and dancing scene, it's because really nobody read a book. So I'm not going to even bother to argue that point. But the thing is, I thought that the one thing that really freaking sold that. I can say Brie Larson stepped up her acting in this movie. So it, it was is it's not Captain Marvel. Is I mean it's not um Captain Marvel the movie. It's not Endgame. It's not Infinity War. So she really kicked it up a notch because with all the hate that she was getting, she really kicked it up a notch. And she and they they that that trio made you feel like they were really cool with each other. And uh, the acting between Yam and Miss Monica Yambo with yeah. her and Bree, yeah, it, it, right. was belie- it, it was it was it was very it was very very believable. And Uman Vellani, we can't, I can't say enough about her. It, she's the first actress to make her own, actually be allowed to make her own storyline in Marvel comics. I do, so, I, do, I do love her. I agree. So as as a nerd, as a as me as a nerd, and her as a nerd. I, it's that lurking scene and uh, also the the villain. The villain oh, needed. Who? The, the villain. The villain. There was a villain in this movie. <laughs> Damn. Wasn't but it like it, what is it, it like? Ronan's drunk cousin. I don't know. This is the certain things I can't I can't argue. There's certain things I can't argue, but the whole storyline between the whole storyline, the whole concept that they had with her and Brie, I do agree with because it it did feel like she was out for revenge, but she was just trying to save her planet. But she was doing it at the fucking in the wrong way. So I do get that, but that's a, a story that's been told a thousand times in Marvel. So that's why it fell short for me. It felt like it was re- it was like a rinse and repeat. 
So what's so what's your grade? Uh, I would give it a C. Oh wow, yo, I am surprised at all of you. I'm not gonna lie. Also, I just I'm sorry, I don't mean to like um I love the fact Wait. that hey, what I'm not gonna see it over a secret invasion though. I you get okay. yeah, fix that. Yeah, I uh so I love the fact that you Actually, said no. uh, I love the fact that you said that uh Brie Larson stepped up her acting game like she's not a Golden Globe or Academy Award winner who needs to step up her acting game. <laughs> Anyway, I digress though. Oh, it's, it, 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 you gotta it's realize it's, it, it's, I digress. It's, it's, no, it's, it's how she's written as well. I agree with exactly. you. It's how she's written, it's how how she's written, written as well. Written. I'm and just making balls like because I don't can. like Captain Nissan. Yeah. You know what? <laughs> if she did her homework, she could have said uh, something about that. But any, yeah. Well, see, I because she's a writer as well. Just saying. And anyway, she did her homework. Anyway, she could have um, said something. I digress though. Let's let's go into what if season two, which. We didn't even really cover on the channel because I don't know. I don't know what it is. shit fell to the fucking left side on me. So you want to talk about the Captain Carter series? <laughs> basically the Captain Carter series. Call yeah, it what that's it is. basically what it was. Yeah. I, 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 I didn't. The, all right. Is this, so I didn't talk much less, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go now. Yeah. I honestly didn't hate this. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I didn't hate it, nope. but it didn't do anything spectacular for me either. Nope. Like. I thought Kahori was actually a dope character they introduced. I, I liked her origin and her backstory, and I liked all that. I thought it was dope. Um, I was super excited about Hela and the Ten Rings, and that story fell flat on its face for me. At the end, I was like, I was like, okay, like whatever. It, it didn't, it didn't quite do what I expected it to do. And then by the end, we just got different versions of Peggy Carter roaming different multiverses and saving. Well, no, no, it's the same version of Peggy Carter. Whatever, but yeah, you know, a whole bunch of different places in a whole bunch of different places. So I'm like. At the end, I'm like, was it okay? Yeah. Like, if I had to give it a ranking, I would probably give it, like, a, a C or a D. Like, it wasn't anything spectacular. Would I rewatch it? Probably not. Like, it was just okay. And I and that sucks because I actually really liked What If Season 1. I enjoyed everything yeah. about it. Absolutely enjoyed What If Season 1. I had a lot of high hopes for What If Season 2. Everything you just said is absolutely true. Uh, Kihori was great, but yeah. the rest of the stories just weren't it like these just weren't the what if stories i was looking for mm -hmm. uh, and i think the big thing for me was that hell in the ten rings one uh -huh. i truly was like this is what i'm getting it felt flat no thank you i don't need hella to be redeemed i need hella to be hella that's what i wanted i wanted to see hella you do don't need no goddamn ten rings i need, need hella to do hella things and um, that's what I was looking forward to. And at that point, I was just like, forget it. And then, of course, you get all of this Captain Carter business. And it was like, you know, if it was live action Carter, now we talking. Well, I don't care about no animated Captain Cannons. Uh, it's, it's just what it is. So I'm going to tell you, just out of respect for season one, I'd probably put it in like a C tier. <laughs> I'll let Chase and Leo go, and then I'll drag yeah, it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, oh, I only like one episode out of the whole thing. You can put that shit at D. Oh! Chase? Wait, wait, which episode did you only like? Just out of curiosity. The new episode. The new the introduction of the new character. That's it. Oh, the Kahori? Kahori? The Kahori, Kahori. story. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's okay. It. That's the only one I like out of the whole fucking thing. I actually did. I actually did think that was really cool. Not gonna like, like the nice. way he did everything. I thought that was a cool origin story, but, you know. It, it, Marvel, for one fucking basic thing, do the old school what ifs. That's what people are fucking which, waiting for. Which, which I just want to, I'm just going to say it. Uh, for everybody who thinks that, like, you know, sometimes we just don't like, not, maybe me specifically, I'm, I'm targeting here, that we don't like origin stories of women. Uh, Kahori's backstory was actually really well done. It was dope. So if you give me a good story, I won't hate right. it. I don't there care if it's a woman or a man. I just, <laughs> I just want a good story. Don't let it be an old woman, but. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, <laughs> he, is, he is ageist. So. Or, or, uh, or somebody who drives Nissans. Anyway, Jesus, die. <laughs> um, I mean, uh, it, listen, I, I'm kind of with with Leo. The the what if 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 you were if you were a kid when we were a kid, the what if stories were were almost magical because mm -hmm. you got to see your favorite superheroes in other ways. It wasn't just a traditional. You know, storyline that you normally would have gotten. Um, trying to remember that this "What If" this year is was was really supposed to be the the Christmas servicing. Mm -hmm. um, you know, 
but it was just so damn lackluster, bro. Like, I, I really wanted to get into it. Some of the ways that they chose some of this, I was just like, what the hell? What if Happy Hogan saved Christmas? Yeah, I'm like, wow, yo, wow, that dude. episode was so stupid. What? I was like, <laughs> that's the is? stupidest episode. You wasted the animation money on that. Yeah, bro. <laughs> and, and this is this is where, you know, Disney runs into this problem about trying to make family friendly movies out of things that are not family friendly. Mm. Yep. Mm. Again, you should have just held on to this shit. Put it on Hulu and put it out the way that it's supposed to be put out. I hope that you do this going for in the future, or else you're just gonna have more meh type of content that should have been actually been fucking dope. Yep. The first season of What If completely caught me out of left field because I did not expect any dope. of that storyline. Mm-hmm. Completely caught me. Mm-hmm. I, I just I, they'll tell you I thought the damn thing was over. I <laughs> didn't even know that there was like two more episodes because I was just so fucking excited and shit. And this one, I just like went through it and I'm like, okay. Um, love Kahori. I love love the character. Love the story and all that. Yeah. The rest of it was just like, okay. I, I didn't I didn't even need this. You could have just mm-hmm. you know, yep. with the Kahori story call us a day. Yep. Um, so I'm Agreed. I'm gonna have to put this in in the uh, in the D category, bro. All right. And I'm okay with. I'm that. I'm okay with that too. Honestly, I was yep. like CD, so I'm I'm kind of there. With to you. Put it in. I'm, in. I'm in to put it there. Um, so I guess we can kind of just take a look at the list. Want to move anything around? Shuffle nope. anything? No. Nope. Leave it where it is. Yeah. Everybody you know. is exactly where they need to belong. Exactly. Huh? Cool. <laughs> and I will, I will say one thing regarding this. So that first off, that will be if you want to take a screenshot, I will take a screenshot later. But anyway, um, I will say one more thing pertaining to what if. That I thought about after, and then we could leave this video alone. What if better not be an indicator for this year's animated projects as far as the Black Panther series? And do not ruin our X-Men 97, or you will be in serious fucking trouble. I want them games. I promise you, you will be in fucking trouble. Yep. I, I want to do it. I am telling you one fucking thing. <laughs> Lord, I, have, I have my fucking Wolverine claws, Mikey. <laughs> I will come and see you, bro. <laughs> I am serious, bro. I will if my man ain't about this big <laughs> and, and has a bad attitude and a cigar in his mouth, <laughs> I will, I'm I going to be pissed off, bro. Yeah. The first <laughs> thing I thought was this. Bombs. The first thing I thought was this better not be an indicator of X Men ninety seven, or I will be, pissed. I will be so pissed. No, I, I, I <laughs> that's not what we're dealing with. But anyway, I digress, and I will let Kevin Feige hopefully delay that project like he did for good reasons because it's going to be amazing, and I can't wait. That's what I'm going with, Kevin Feige, because it's positive vibes in twenty twenty four. If not. You're gonna be hearing from somebody. Just saying. Yeah, he's coming for you. <laughs> anyway, that will do it for a tier list. Let us know down below in the comments. Do you agree? Do you disagree? I'm assuming a bunch of you are gonna put some things into D tier. That's just my assumption. But anyway, that's our list, and this is our channel, so we do what we want. Damn right. <laughs> I love that. But of course, let us know down below in the comments section uh, what you think. Um, and of course, please check us out on all forms of social media. YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, Twitch, Apple Podcasts, Spotify, Kick and Rumble. We are also live streaming now on YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram Thursdays at 8 p.m. Eastern. So please check us out. We go items like this all the time where we get into debates <laughs> and talk about different things from the nerd universe. Yeah. And until the next tier list, we will catch you guys in. Keep wondering what is. Anatomically correct, baby. <laughs> The yams, big yams, little yams, yams. small yams, yams, yams. 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 yams.